Hi guys, so a look inside the Motorola Talk About T62 and Silvercrest PMR446 radio from Lidl. As I try and figure out if these are actually from the same factory. Um, which is entirely possible, but who knows. So the Motorola uses this as its main processor. It's one of these chip on board things. And this is a processor in the Silvercrest. I have no idea what it is. It might be a software defined radio chip thing I don't know there's another 8 pin device at the top there not sure you can see that it's probably a bit out of focus actually we'll focus on that just there no idea what it is there's one down there as well on the Motorola possibly the same function I don't know there's two screen sections in the silver crest but one large screen section in the Motorola so the USB charger ports are on their separate boards. On the Motorola it's connected straight like that. So I'm not sure why a computer seems to think it's a device and then obviously automatically fails. Not quite understood that. On the Silvercrest, we've got the board, but it's got the connections for the data pins for the USB port. So it is possible that those can be connected to something inside for programming purposes. But otherwise, as it is, it's just a charging port. The connections are pluggable on here, so you can unplug the, the LED and unplug the battery charge contacts on the Silvercrest. On the Motorola, it's done. The charging contacts and battery contacts are done by these little metal bits here, and the batteries themselves on the Silvercrest do make contact with parts of the board. I think on the Motorola, it's quite similar, but I can't see where that obviously would go. Now, looking at the Motorola's lid. Yeah, it does look like on the, on the Motorola that a couple of those contacts are used for the battery plus and minus. Sorry if the light's flaring out a bit on that. Yeah, so that's what's inside these. You can't really do any adjustments. I'm not going to take the boards right out because on both of them, I've got to desolder the, the speaker. So it's not ideal. So I can't actually remove the boards. So that's what's inside them, but it doesn't really help me on figuring out whether these are actually made in the same factory by the same people. But they do have those hallmarks that they might be.